Hello, wonderful people here today for this vegan taste test for these two new products from Bird's Eye. Bird's Eye have just released two new mock meat items in the Coles supermarkets. Bird's Eye plant-based chicken style nuggets and their Bird's Eye plant-based chicken style fingers. These are in the freezer section and today I am just going to whip them into the air fryer and let you know if these new mock meat items are worth your money. So let's go into this straight away. So these cooked up extremely easily in the air fryer, about eight minutes in the air fryer. So just mixed it around to make sure it got crispy on all sides there. So this is the fingers and nuggets have just cooked up a couple each to see how these taste. So these are a new freezer item that is now available at Coles supermarkets for $7.30 each. And they are a 300 gram packet. What is actually a massive positive for a lot of people, no plastic waste with this item at all, just the cardboard and then the item items in there which is always a win for less plastic anyway friends let's try out these new fingers first to see if they are worth your money So both of these products are soy, wheat, and mung bean based protein. They have a super crispy batter around it that has crisped up perfectly. If you can hear this crisp here. Despite being soy and wheat based, it doesn't actually have any overpowering soy or wheat taste to this at all, which is always fantastic. Some other nugget items on the market have a very distinct and strong wheat or soy flavor, whereas this one is quite plain. In terms of texture of that mock chicken itself, it doesn't have a lot of stringy texture. It is a little bit mushy. Textually, it could definitely be better. There have been other nuggets on the market which have better texture. I feel like this is more in line with what I remember like a McDonald's nugget actually being like a little bit mushy with not a lot of texture in that mock meat. So major points for that really crispy butter. It is a perfect coating around this. Just a little bit of a shame with the texture of the mock meat itself. So I could imagine that the nuggets are going to be pretty much the same here. Pretty much the same ingredients in the nuggets as the fingers. What actually does get me is the size of these nuggets are tiny as. These are probably the tiniest plant-based nuggets out on the market. But nevertheless, it looks like it has crisped up perfectly as well. Again, a super crispy coating, which is fantastic. That crunch is unbelievable. The batter is really nice. And again, with the filling, wheat, soy, mung bean base, but no overpowering flavors there, which is always fantastic. Again, the texture probably could be a little bit better. It's probably a little bit mushy. You don't get like that stringy texture as you would expect with some chicken products. Overall, again, a not bad option here. The plant-based nugget market has really kind of flipped around in recent years. There used to be a bunch of vegan friendly nuggets on the market and now there only seems to be only a handful left. Some of the options are great, some not so great. These, they are a pretty good option. They're probably not the best plant-based nugget that I have personally tried, but it is overall a really great package. The crispy outing is its major winning point. It is so crunchy, which I really enjoy. The texture of the mock meat itself probably is the letdown that hurts it the most. It is a little bit mushy. If it had a little bit more texture on the mock meat, it probably would go so much further, but no overpowering weeds or soy taste on this at all, which is a massive bonus as well. So another positive for these new items is that they are actually fortified with zinc and B12. A lot of questions get asked about how vegans get their B12, but a lot of these mock meat items now are fortified. So another easy way to get your B12 and zinc in the form of these 
is high in protein as well, which is fantastic and super convenient. I really love how super convenient these are. $7.30 each, you can whip them out, chuck them in the air fryer for about 10 minutes and you have an easy and delicious snack ready to go. Chicken style fingers have not been on the market before, so it is refreshing to see a new mock meat item being released by a company like Bird's Eye. Bird's Eye have some amazing mock meat options and these are a great continuation of their mock meat range. They've got burgers, they've got mints, they've got their best Greek style lamb strips as well. And these two new products slot in perfectly as being a really affordable and great mock meat item. If you're looking for your nuggets with a little bit more stringy texture, these are unfortunately not it. But otherwise, both of these products are still a fantastic option. Highly recommend going to check them out in your Coles supermarkets. But anyway, friends, of course, that is just my opinion. If you have tried either of these products, please let me know your opinion down below. And after this video, why not watch this video on the other plant-based mock meat range from Birdseye. But anyway, friends, until next time, I will catch you very, very soon.